This is the pile that my husband's getting rid of. This is for music panel DIY. These are going to my mom. This is stuff that I'm keeping from his pile. Three shirts and a sweater. And then also for the music panel thing. And then I'm gonna try to make this into a dress. That's the other box. Okay, so here's one music panel down. I didn't make it, my husband did. And then these are the other three started. Okay, so we got rid of the two boxes last Monday. Um, the first box I showed was my husband's clothes that he got rid of. And the second box was mostly my things and then some household things that I decluttered over like the past few months. Um, so yeah, I finally got rid of that stuff. So it's not in my garage anymore. Other update is that I think I'm going to end up making a curtain out of the band t-shirts. Um, so yeah, so my husband said that they don't fit him anymore. And I would feel like a poser wearing them. So I decided to make a curtain out of them. And then this is where I'm planning on putting the curtain. Maybe I'll do one for here too, but I have not decided. I guess it doesn't work for the music panels because of the plasticky part of them. So that's why I'm going to make a curtain and then so this is the only item that I held on to from the declutter pile. Um, it's too small. I got rid of it last week but I still want to keep it in this box for a bit longer. I wasn't ready for it to go away forever. So anyway and then as for me the only thing I'm going to get rid of is this thing. Um, it like doesn't keep a charge which now I am scared to put this in the trash now. Anyway, I guess I'll throw it out once it like stops lighting up. It's an electric lighter and it worked really great before, but now it doesn't hold the charge. Like if I charge it up, I can only light up one candle and that's it. The thing that I ended up saving was this mop because like the sprayer doesn't work, but I can still use it without it. Um, the reason why I had to declutter it is because I got a steam mop, but the steam mop is too much work. So. I ended up keeping this, you know, along with this thing. And then last week, I was not fashionable at all. It was just all very casual wear. Apparently, I was a big Star Wars fan last week. Well, I'm going to stop recording what I wear. Um, so I'm probably not going to make a video like this anytime soon. Um, I will continue to go through my closet and wear my closet um, and see what else I can declutter. And once I have a bigger batch, I will make another video. I definitely have gotten rid of you know, the stuff that's too tight and or too tattered. So I feel good about that. There's still things that are too tattered or too tight, but I guess I'm not ready to let go of them. Okay, so that Monday we went to Home Depot and to drop off stuff at Goodwill and I wore the Star Wars shirt and I thought it was a cute outfit. I like the cute little clips. Um, so yeah, I should wear those clips more often. And then the next day, I went to drop off my voting ballot. So another casual day, I wore the long sleeve that I stole from my husband. That technically I gave to him, but it didn't fit him anywhere. Okay, and then a casual Home Depot <laughs> attire again the next day. And then on Friday, we went wine tasting, so I dressed up a little bit more. I wore my new skirt along with the shirt with the holes. Um, I really like that shirt. I really like that skirt. Um, I don't know, I felt cute that day. I did a little braid like that. Forgot to take a picture. And then the next day, another Home Depot trip. <laughs> um, as I mentioned, anyway, I really do want to wear that shirt out like a normal shirt, which I guess I technically did, but it was over a sweater. I would like to try and wear it with um, a sweater without a hoodie to see how it would look with the little collar. Anyway, that's it for me. Thank you for watching. Bye.